Hey everyone, this is Diana from Arvis and Love, and today I'm going to show you how to make this very lovely bow. This is like a cupcake pattern. Um, we're going to make two of them to um, put them in pigtails. And this one is like more of like a birthday pattern type um, with the, the light blue and the pink and then the cupcakes on it. So, what you will need is um, six strips here of any color that you want. These, this is 7 8 inch ribbon. Um, and then one, and these are all eight inches long, okay? Then I have one on the very top that is seven inch cut. I have a little strip here for this tiny bow right on top and a little gem, um, a little felt piece. I cut out about two inch circle um, for the felt, a lined alligator clip, and this is about two and a fourth inches and this is lined if you need a tutorial on that I'll put a link here um, and I just bought the felt in um, squares at the store and I think I bought them when they're like four for a dollar when they're on sale for the little poof I used marabou and I have a marabou boa here and I got this from Hobby Lobby and I used my 40% off coupon so, um, that is all you'll need besides your glue gun. So we'll go ahead and get started. So what we need to first do is take your strip, light the ends of course, and then we're going to just go like this and flip it around and you kind of want to try to keep it in the middle. So if you want to, you can fold it in half to see where your middle, middle is and mark it if you need to. Otherwise you can go like this and we're just going to flip and we're going to have them kind of meet in the middle. They can overlap but they don't have to. It doesn't have to be exact. And then I'm just going to go underneath and glue those two and voila. That is it. I'll show you one more time and then I'll fast forward through this part or just skip skip over it. And here's another one. All I did is flip this around and then flip the other part around. And it's just like a Christmas bow, like that you'd put on a package during Christmas that you buy from the store. Except we're using Grogring ribbon. So there we go. So I'll finish these up real quick and then we'll continue on on how to layer this all together. Okay, so I have them all together and I wanna do it in this layering pattern because they're gonna be, um, you know, the exact same in pigtails. Um, you, of course, you can use a brett if you want to, but I use the alligator clip. So I'm gonna start with the blue at the bottom and then the next layer that comes is pink. So we're just gonna glue right there. No needle required in this one. And then next layer here I have is the cupcake. So we'll put this here. And then we have cupcake again. And then we have the blue and pink. Oh, this wasn't glued the best. Let me glue that down. Okay. So then we have blue again. Layer this right on top here. And then, of course, try to keep it right in the middle. And then we have pink. So I'm just trying to rotate the colors here. And of course you can do it with just one color, one pattern, if you would like. And then, I wanna scoot this over and rotate a little bit. And then we have this cupcake right on top. So I'm just gonna do it this way, like that. 
There's glue everywhere. And voila. Already done. So, um, I have a little bit of tool, and if you want to add that, I do about three inches of this, but I'm just going to guess right here. And then all I'm doing is folding it in half, kind of squeezing the bottom, and I'm just going to add a little bit of glue right there, and then I'm just going to push it down, kind of to the side. And with this bow, you could do pretty much anything. If you want to add in some corker ribbon, um, you could even add tool between the layers, pretty much anything that you want. Um, here we're going to use the marabou, and you don't need much of this at all. So I'm just going to cut a little slit, and this looks like about two inches. And then I'm going to glue the ends together. Like this. There we go. And then just put some glue right there. And poke it in. There we go. We're almost done already. And there's feathers everywhere. Um, all I'm going to do is make a little tiny bow. Um, you're probably going to need, I don't know, let's say like four inches or so. It's really not that much of um, this ribbon here. Let me make this tail a little bit longer. And all I'm doing is going like this, flipping it around and flipping it around again because we're going to put... Um, a gem in the middle so I'm just opening it up a little bit and putting a little glue in there and pushing it down and put a little glue on the back and I'm gonna put it right there voila grab my little gem And put it right there. You could you could even have this as just one bow to go on top of the little girl's head. Um, but I think it'd be really cute as pigtails. In in the pigtails. So that is it. And then we have our little circle here. All I'm gonna do is go like this, flip it around. Glue this, flip it over, and put it on. Like always, don't glue all the way to the edge, because we need that part to be able to still open it. And I am actually going to start selling these. I've, I've made the, these before in previous years and sold them, but I'm going to actually start selling these. Um, on my Etsy shop so if you don't want to make it you can definitely go to my shop and check that out and this is it so we have two cute little bows that you can put into your um, your daughters or whoever's pigtails or else you can just put one on top of the head especially if it's an infant one probably would be good enough for that um, and that's it this is completely done I hope you guys liked the video. Please leave a like or subscribe, and I'll be doing some new different videos here soon. Thanks for watching. Bye!